Okay, this is going to be a quick video on how to root the Samsung Epic 4G from Sprint. Let's turn this sucker on real quick. Okay, um, we're going to go to Menu, Settings, then we're going to go to uh, Applications, Development, and you have to make sure these two options are checked, uh, USB Debugging and Stay Awake. Okay, once you do that, download the file, well, download the, the file to the link that I provide, and then zip it, and you're going to see all these folders, or two folders in all these files. Um, install, these are both drivers for the Samsung uh, uh, Epic 4G. So what you got to do is install the correct drivers. So if you have a 64-bit operating system, the 64-bit one, and the 32-bit. Okay, I have the 64-bit, I already installed them, so all you have to do is just go down to the bottom where it says setup.exe, and install them. That's all you got to do. Then get your cable. You got to Connecting it to the very top. Okay, it's going to say uh, USB connected and it's going to say uh, USB debugging connected. That's what you want. Once you do that, you're going to go to run.b.bat. Then you're just going to hit uh, any key on there. I hit enter. Just wait a little bit. It's going to drop the AB, um, ABD connection. So you're going to hear it click a bit. There you go. See, it just dropped it. And it's going to reestablish it um, using the exploit, and then there you go. It's going to transfer some last minute files. It's going to say uh, it's going to reboot your phone once you press any key. I'm going to hit enter again. And that's all you got to do. At this point, you're going to see that we now have root and uh, busybox. Applications. Phone's still loading, so if you're wondering where I got this from, since you're probably saying this is TouchWiz and not uh, Sense or HTC Sense, I uh, just got the weather widget. That's uh, cardio trainer up there. Come on. It's amazing how slow these phones load sometimes. Worse than computers. Okay. What you want to do is, uh, let's see, where's Super User? Oh, actually, Super User, I don't think actually appears, does it? Maybe it doesn't. Let's try Wi Fi Tether, though. And then just install Wi Fi Tether from the market. There you go. And then now you should have Wi Fi Tether. It is Wi-Fi tether. And there you go. That's how you uh, rooted Epic 4G.